Okay, today we're going to talk about uh, robbing the comb honey, that is taking the comb honey from the hive. And it's a warm day, uh, hot in fact, and, and you can uh, see the bees uh, fanning their wings, they're trying to cool their hive. And likewise uh, with the other hives uh, down the row. So we're going to take some supers off the off the hive and show you what we do. Okay, we're going to uh, we keep a something heavy on top to keep the wind from blowing the top off. And I'm going to take the top off. And you can see the bees on top of the hive. This is a, a gentle, pretty bunch of hive bees. And uh, everything I do, I, I do it s slow and try not to to bump it. The more gentle you are, then the more gentle they are. I'm going to raise this. Uh, this box we call a super. And usually it has 10, 10 frames in it, evenly spaced. So I'm going to raise this up and let you have a look at the underside. Okay, I'm going to turn this, uh, this top super around where you can see the, the underside of it. And you can see the, the, the comb there, the white comb. And uh, now this super has not, this one here has not been fully capped. So I'm going to set it off and pull the next one up and show it to you. They're full of honey and uh, full of bees. Now you'll see the comb honey. Now between the frames, sometimes they will build burr comb in there. If there's any extra space, they will build extra comb. So what I'm going to do right now is smoke these bees and, and then gently blow the rest of them out, try to get all the bees out of the super as I can, and then I'll pull a, a frame of honey out and show it to you. When you... Uh, when you, uh, when a beekeeper uh, makes comb honey, we, we specialize in comb honey, uh, you don't make near as much honey as the beekeepers that extract their honey. Now I'm just blowing this smoke across the top of the hive, across the top of the super. We call this box a super. These are frames. But I'm blowing it across the top I'm not blowing it down into the supers. I just want to kind of get them moving a little bit. And then I'll, I'll stand it up on end again and use a blower to, to uh, gently blow them out. We, do, we don't use any chemicals to get the bees out of the hive, so it's chemical free. I'm going to blow the bees out of the super. When you, when you harvest comb honey like we do, you have to be very careful when you take them out because uh, if you take them out wrong, uh, this, this burr comb here will scratch or damage the, the comb honey next to it. So I'm going to take this one right here on the end. I'm going to take it out first. It looks like my best shot. And then we'll go from there. And I'll show you what...
K. That's a that's a that's a beautiful frame of comb honey. Absolutely beautiful. Maybe you can get a good shot up there. And I'm gonna lay it there. And then uh, the next one I take out. The kings and queens of all time cannot buy better honey than this right here. It's absolutely wonderful. And uh, again, here's another frame of the comb honey. I hope you can get a good look at it. And you see this extra comb honey that's right here, that they built right here and right here. Uh, we have to be careful when we pull each one out because this sticks out a little bit and it would maybe scratch the other one so we try to be careful so it it, it won't hurt the honey but it, it might scratch the uh, the surface now the honeybees uh, make this hunt they build the they build this comb it's virgin comb uh, and they build the comb and then they make the honey in the comb and when the comb is ready uh, it's cured then they will cap it with wax so this, this entire surface right here is what, what we call cappings. They cap the honey, so down the road, when, when they're ready for it, they, then, then they can uncap it and uh, uh, use it. And the, the, the aroma and the flavor of that honey is sealed in that comb with these cappings. It's absolutely beautiful. It's absolutely wonderful. Uh, so I'm going to put these back in here just like I took them out. If you have any questions or uh, anything, you can email us or call us and, and uh, we'll be happy to answer your questions. Uh, and this is uh, Durham's Bee Farm, www durham's d-u-r-h-a-m-s b-e-e f-a-r-m dot com durham's bfarm dot com thank you and have a good day okay in case you're wondering we do sell the comb honey in this frame just like it is just like it come out of the beehive uh, but we, we don't ship it uh, people pick it up but they, ha they have to have a way of uh, transporting it so it, does, so it doesn't get damaged. Now in case you wonder, this uh, uh, this right here is, is uh, burr comb. We call it burr comb. Like for example, you can see right here, the bees will build some some extra comb uh, on the frame and we, 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 we trim it off and that's what this is here.